hi there so in this tutorial i'm going to show you how you can use regular expression function to check for pattern match on a particular string and then output a particular message depending on if the pattern is found within string so the function that we are going to look here is break match which spelled as p r e g underscore m a t c h okay so this is the function that we are going to look in this program so let's first start by creating a string called string one and type check sublime text editor okay and now i'm going to have if loop inside this loop i'm going to check for match in the break match function we're going to check for text sublime Now we are also giving it the entire string to check. Now here we are going to echo the message that if you find the string contains the word sublime. Okay, so if the string is matched with the word we want then this message will be code if not then we are gonna have a different message as else okay which is going to be go a string hash string one okay, let me correct it previous message as well does not contain the word sublime okay now this is pretty much simple program to understand how preg match works what we have done here is we have created a string with message check sublime text editor then inside if loop i'm using preg match function and I'm checking for the word sublime in string one as our variable. So these are the two variables that are passed to this function. If it returns true, then this message will be equal. If it returns false, then this message will be shown on screen. So let's execute the program. Okay, so I'm here and I have this file on my localhost. Let me execute this. Okay, the string check sublime text editor does not contain the word sublime. Why this turns out to be false? The reason is the way we check for sublime word here should be properly So if it's not properly quoted, then it could result in issues. So this is the text that we are supposed to look for. Okay. Now, as you can see, the string where I have wrote the word sublime starts with capital S, whereas the word I'm checking here is in small letters. Okay, so only way to validate this is by making the word uppercase here. It starts with capital S. And now we can simply execute this. 
Okay, now the string check sublime text editor contains the word sublime. So it is very case sensitive as it is checking for the pattern. So even if it is one uppercase, one lowercase or so, that way it could lead to more of a mismatch. So you have to be very careful even if the two words are same, a single uppercase or lowercase character can make the difference. So now you understand that how break match function is checking for the pattern match within the string. So this is very helpful when you are doing validation tasks or comparing the data and filtering the output that you need. So I hope you find this tutorial helpful. If you have any question, let me know and I will see what I can do to help with. So, thank you for watching the video.